This is Passam Kamanakin, written by Nancy Von Lund, illustrated by George Booth. When you listen to the story, every time you hear the words, Passam Kamanakin at the door, I want you to do two claps like that. So practice it with me. Passam Kamanakin at the door. Passam Kamanakin at the door. All right, so we're going to try that with the book. Here we go. Knock, 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 knock. Bunch of possum footprints there. And Possum Come a Knockin' by Nancy Von Lund, illustrated by George Booth. Possum Come a Knockin' at the door, at the door. Possum Come a Knockin' at the door. <coughs> Granny was a sittin' and a rockin' and a knittin' when a possum come a knockin' at the door. Ma was busy cooking in the kitchen making taters when a possum come a knockin' at the door. Pa was busy fixin' and a bangin' and a poundin' when a possum come a knockin' at the door. Pappy was a whittlin' making play toys for the baby when a possum come a knockin' at the door. Sis was tossin' baby while Pappy was a whittlin' when a possum come a knockin' at the door. Brother was untangling all the twiny line for fishing, while sis was tossing baby, and pappy was a whittlin', and pa was busy fixin', and ma was busy cookin', and granny was a knittin' when a possum come a knockin' at the door. <coughs> Coon dog was a twitchin' and a scratchin' in the corner when a possum come a knockin' at the door. Tomcat started sniffing and a spitting and a hissing when a possum come a knocking at the door. <coughs> What's that? Sis said. Don't know, brother said. What's that? Pa said. Don't know, Granny said. But that cat, she said, that cat ought to go. Then dog started sniffing and a pawing and a growling while the cat tail a twitching was a hissing and a howling, making Granny stop a knitting and Pappy stop a whittling and Baby start a fussing, sis and brother start a cussing, cause a little old possum was a knocking at the door. <coughs> What's that? Granny said. Don't know, Pappy said. What's that? Ma said. Don't know, Pa said. Then I creepy crossed the floor and peeked under the door. It's a possum coming knocking on the door, I said. It's a possum coming knocking on the door. <coughs> then brother came a leaping and sis came a running and baby came a crawling and dog started howling and pappy was a chuckling and granny's eyes was twinkling as Ma followed Pa to the door. Now hush, Pa said. Now hush, Ma said. And slowly Pa opened up the door. Now y'all stop your hollering, your fussing, and your cussing, because there's nothing that's a knocking at the door. <coughs> no possum, Pappy said. No possum, Pa said. No possum, Granny said. No possum, Ma said. Then we all started doing like before. Granny was a sittin' while Pappy was a whittlin'. Ma was a cookin' while Pa was a fixin'. Brother was untanglin' while Sis was tossin' baby. Coon dog was a scratchin' while Tomcat was a lickin'. And I was just a sittin' and a lookin' out the window when I saw what I saw scoot up the old oak tree. A possum was a scootin' and a scramblin' and a danglin'. That possum that was knockin' me to fool out of me. We got footprints going off the page. Knock, 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 knock. And then the characters who were in the house. We have Pa, Granny, Pappy, Ma, Sis, Baby, Tomcat, Coon Dog, Brother, me, who's the narrator of the story, and that silly old possum that kept knocking on the door. Sorry that this was a little bit blurry, but uh, it's just how unfortunately it got copied. So, 
that was possum coming knocking at the door after you are after you leave this what you're going to do is there's going to be a google slide that you can listen to some fun rhythm patterns for each of the characters so have fun with that and i will see you guys next time bye